Minecraft. Talking about Minecraft. Hello and welcome back to the exciting world of Minecraft. This is episode 2 in our series and we are going to kick things off right where we left off. And I'm hoping I don't die. Here we go. There's a creeper and a zombie waiting to kill me. I think I'm going to make a sword real quick. There it is. Alright. Alright, come and get me. Oh, he sees me. He sees me. What? Hello. How's it going? Um, that's weird. Here you go. <laughs> I don't know what to say about this. Whoa! That was weird. Maybe he's narcoleptic or something. Anyway, so that creeper gave me an idea. Um, a few weeks ago, I wanted to make a certain type of mob trap. I had an idea, and I'm going to try and make it this video. It's very simple. Um, first I'm going to get some wood, though. Basically, I'm going to need four doors and a pressure plate. And that's pretty much all the trap is. Alright, that's good enough. And... Any type of pressure plate. So I, I haven't made sure... I don't know if this works for sure, but I think it does. I haven't built it off camera or anything like that, so this is the first time I'm seeing it and the first time you're seeing it. Basically, just decide where you want to put it. Get your four doors. And I'm going to put it above my little station here, because I think there will be lots of uh, creepers walking around here. And just put your four doors around you. Like that. And get your pressure plate. Put it inside. Oh. So that doesn't work because the doors are reversed. But there is a way to fix that. Start over here. So if you need to reverse doors, you need a block next to the door. Whoa. Oh, that's a hole I dug. Okay, so... That's the wrong way. So we need the door hinge on this side. Like that. So now the door is going to be open by default. And when they step on the pressure plate, it closes. Yeah, I think that's what I want to do. Oh, you know what? I put the door the wrong way. Ah! Okay, this time. Uh, 
there. That's what I want. So that was on the right side, I think. Yes. So place the four doors like that. Get rid of your sand. And that's our trap. So if a creeper walks in here, he's automatically trapped. He can't get out. Um, unless maybe if he jumps. Yeah, if he jumps, he can get out. So we're going to put a block above also. And you can use you could use a glass block if you want him to be killed by the sunlight. But I'm just going to use a regular block. So I think that should hold hold him. Yeah, the doors don't open now when I jump. So that's my very simple mob trap. And I'm hopefully I'll catch somebody tonight to see if it works. Now I'm guessing you can also probably modify this trap to only catch chickens if you want. I think uh, all you would need to do is lower this block by one so that the trap is only one block high and only chickens will be able to fit in it. And uh, you could probably also change it to the base area here to a 2x2 two two if you wanted it to catch spiders instead of this 1x1 one one area. But uh, I'm not going to bother trying to do that. I'm sure you can figure it out if you want using the same idea. Um, what you would use it for, I don't really know. That's up to you. Personally, I'm hoping a creeper will walk into it randomly tonight and I can come here and point and laugh at it. <laughs> but we'll see. If you, if you want, you can direct mobs into it somehow or set up many of them. I don't know. I'll leave it up to you. That's the design, though. Very simple. Alright. So, I think... I'm going to start a new project. I'm going to try and make a tree farm. Because... In my last world, I didn't build a tree farm. And I regretted it later. Because I thought uh, Notch was going to fix the sapling issue of them not falling from trees. And every day I kept hoping, you know, please fix the issue. And he never did. Well, he did one day. I saw on his blog that he fixed it. But then like a few minutes later, he, he undid the change because it was causing crashes. And he, I don't think he's worked on it since. So I'm going to build a tree farm so that I don't run out of wood in this in this world. I think I'll just build it, try to find a nice flat spot for it. Uh, there's more ocean over there. Don't need that. Probably going to have to build it somewhere around here. Oh, a pig, finally. I'm hungry. I don't know where he went. Come on, come on, wherever you are. Aha. Oh, that cheap bugger. Nighttime already. I just started. Yes, I'm gonna build the tree farm around here, I think. And I might. 
have to level this out a bit. And I'll probably work on it in my next day. I'll probably die if I try to build it tonight. I really need to make some kind of storage chest or else I'm going to lose everything. So I think I'm going to go hide. And work on the road a bit more. I'll probably have lots of projects going at a time, because I don't like to work on just one thing. Uh, make a chest. Or two. And... Oh, that's where the chicken fell down. one of these type of holes. Anyway. Build a chest. Store my junk. And yeah. So I'm going to build a furnace too. And I'll probably make some glass. Alright, so I'm just going to clear out some more of this area here off camera. And I'll see you in a bit. Zoom, zoom. Alright, so cleared out some space. I lowered everything by one block and got some cobblestone, two pieces of iron. I installed a little skylight here so I can see when it's day. Just turned day. And I'm going to hit outside. I don't think I caught anybody. Nope. It was pretty quiet all night. Alright, well, that's the end of this video, and thanks for watching. I'll see you next episode. Whoa, 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 wait one second now. As soon as I stopped the video, I saw this creeper over here. So we're going to try lure him into our trap before we end this to see if it works. And I hope it does. Oh man. Awesome. Now he is stuck forever. That's pretty cool. How's it going in there? Oh yeah, I wanted to see where that chicken went to. He's not down there anymore. That's weird. Okay, until next time. See ya.